Hey guys, this is Charlie with Wichita Homeworks. I uh, just thought I'd uh, give you another chance to look in on what we're doing for projects here today. Uh, we've got a uh, home here that we're uh, actually uh, putting a little uh, 10, uh, 12 by 12 uh, addition on to. And then as you can see, we've got a patio that we're adding on to that. Uh, we're kind of just finishing up the framing stage. We're ready for uh, utilities to be put in the uh, heating, uh, cooling, and electrical. Uh, there is no plumbing in this. Obviously, there's no sinks or something like that in it. It's kind of just a living room space. Uh, we'll be adding a uh, ceiling fan interior and exterior uh, to give it a little bit of uh, a nice look. Uh, you can see right here we're uh, doing the uh, uh, rough sawn cedar posts. Uh, as well as a smooth cedar for the decking, which gives that, again, a nice little contrast. Um, we've got a really nice uh, French door here on the uh, back side of it. Uh, gives them a, kind of a nice view uh, out of it uh, into their backyard, which is a nice space. Um, you can see right here, we're actually framing up our stairs that wrap all the way around it. Um, there's only uh, three steps here, so we won't. It won't require a railing. However, the customer requested it uh, here for safety's sake. So we're adding one in right there. You can see the post uh, that we're working on. Um, also, the customer uh, has access to uh, uh, reside the home while we're at it. Uh, obviously, we'd have to side the new addition. Get out of the guy's way here. We're getting a little noisy. Um, so what we're doing is we're adding a. Uh, styrofoam uh, insulation here. It's an Owens Corning. It's about three-eighths of an inch thick. Um, this provides both a vapor barrier to some degree and uh, just adds a little bit more to the R value uh, of the uh, home. Uh, any chance you get a chance to uh, make it a little more airtight, make it a little more insulative uh, for the extremes we see here in Kansas, that's always a great idea. Um, as you can see here as well, um, on the top, uh, fascia. You can see it right up here and right over here on the windows. We actually take and uh, custom wrap each window, uh, sill, and uh, sides so that uh, uh, then when we run in here with the vinyl siding, it makes a really nice finished look. Uh, this, this color will match the uh, siding. Um, we can get uh, any coil we need to uh, you know, match those up or some folks like to put a little contrast on them. Uh, you know, against a darker color, sometimes they'll add a, a little lighter color, so we can do that as well. Uh, that's completely up to uh, the owner or uh, your choice. Um, we're getting our starter strips uh, put on to start putting the vinyl siding on. You can see a little J-channel we're putting in up over here on the, this is called a J-channel, a uh, larger one for the base of the uh, cement here, and it'll be caulked down um, and sealed up good so that we don't have any uh, water or uh, air issues uh, on it. We're walking around here. Um, you can see how we've uh, taken and wrapped even this little beam. Now they didn't want anything done underneath this uh, little awning over their porch, uh, but we did wrap the edges and the cap the end of their beam there for them, so it gives it a little nice, nice finished look, uh, especially once we get the siding on the house. You can see back here we did the same thing. We'll uh, get the vents uh, covered with a new uh, vents that uh, match the siding so everything looks like it's all all uh, been put together. Um, I think that's kind of a rundown of what we're doing here. Uh, let's see if I've got anything else. I think we'll, what we'll do is we'll walk in the space yet. I kind of wanted to show you. Uh, I skipped it when I went around there. I meant to show you. Uh, hang on a second here. We'll go around the corner. And we'll go into the actual space here. Um, this is added kind of a, we uh, added a vaulted ceiling in here. Being this is just a little bit smaller, um, oops, losing me here. Uh, being this is a little bit smaller space, if we can put that uh, vaulted ceiling in there, or even coffered, which is the ones you see that have kind of a step in the ceiling and then it goes higher, that always gives the room a, a much larger, much roomier feel for no bigger than it really is. Uh, so uh, we're in the framing stage here. I think we have electricians coming tomorrow. They're going to uh, wire us up. We'll put in the standard uh, plugs that are required, as well as the uh, ceiling fan up here at the peak, um, associated switches, and the rest. So, um, again, as always, here at Wichita Homeworks, uh, if you see anything you like, uh, please give us a call. 
We're always happy to come out. Estimates are free. Uh, we'll work with you. We have designers on staff. Uh, we can make uh, anything you like and uh, create a lot nicer uh, living space for you. Thanks for listening, guys. I'll uh, check in with you again.